The men and women of labor and Caribbean communities proudly march down East Chester Road for the annual celebration of Caribbean heritage and the labor movement. We represent a large majority of the Caribbean population in the Bronx. Uh, we have a lot of Jamaicans up here, Trinidadians, all peoples are part of all the Caribbean islands. Um, we're just celebrating culture. Um, we're just going to walk down, showcase uh, that we're all in this together. Hosted by Senator Jamal T. Bailey, he wanted to emphasize the Caribbean population in the Bronx as it is often overlooked and speculated that Brooklyn is more so the home of Caribbean culture. They may have larger populations, but we have the best, right? We, we have the best up here in the Bronx. Um, the, it, it's so many different Caribbean islands, so many different different types of food and culture. Other marchers, like District Attorney Darcel Clark, who says she grew up in a Southern Black family, recognize the contributions that the Caribbean heritage has made in the Bronx. I love the Caribbean heritage, and I've always, you know, wanted to be a part of it. That's why I moved to this neighborhood is one of the reasons, because of it. Just contributes so much to the Bronx. After marching down, attendees were treated to a reception where they continued to sing, dance, and celebrate their culture. Until next year, reporting for BronxNet, Brittany Schuyler-Albain.